A train arrives at the station. It's four o'clock. Did the train arrive because it was four o'clock, or is it four o'clock because the train arrived? This philosophical paradox has puzzled minds for centuries, emphasizing the question of whether time is passive or actively involved in physical processes. The idea that time is a passive illusion, a mere human construct, has long been debated in both scientific and philosophical circles. However, at the end of 2024, Italian physicists provided a groundbreaking answer to this puzzle, with results that could shake the foundations of Einstein's general relativity and our understanding of space-time. For those who believe time is a mere illusion shaped by human perception, prepare to be challenged. Throughout history, humanity has struggled to grasp the true nature of time. Yet, a recent experimental study conducted in Italy suggests that time, at the quantum level, may be an active element rather than a passive backdrop. If proven true, this could force a reevaluation of Einstein's space-time model, which describes time as a dimension intertwined with space, but fundamentally passive. Albert Einstein revolutionized our understanding of time with his theories of relativity. He showed us how speed and gravity can alter the passage of time, a concept experimentally confirmed many times. However, the recent Italian study hints that time might be far more dynamic than previously thought, challenging the classical idea of time as a passive dimension. In quantum mechanics, time has traditionally been treated as an external parameter separate from the physical system itself. It does not affect quantum states directly. However, macroscopic systems appear to follow a time flow, leading to inconsistencies between quantum mechanics and general relativity. Theoretical physicists Don N. Page and William K. Wooters proposed a radical solution to this issue in 1983. They suggested that time could be an emergent property of entanglement between quantum systems rather than an independent entity. Page, mentored by Stephen Hawking and Wooters, a pioneer in quantum information theory, developed a model where time arises from correlations between subsystems. In their view, time is not absolute but relative to the relationship between two systems. Imagine a clock. It doesn't measure time independently, but gains meaning when related to the motion of other events, like the arrival of a train. Similarly, at the quantum level, one subsystem can act as a clock, measuring the evolution of another subsystem. This theory remained theoretical until the 2024 experiment conducted by Italian physicists Alessandro Capo, Alessandro Cuckley, and Paolo Verrucci. Using the page wooters framework, they designed a procedure to test whether time is a relational phenomenon at the quantum level. The experiment involved two systems. Clock system, modeled as a spin system where a magnetic moment oscillates between two states. Evolving system, a harmonic oscillator, such as a mass oscillating on a spring. The two systems were entangled, but did not interact directly. The clock system spin state determined the position of the harmonic oscillator. As the spin flipped, the oscillator state evolved, revealing a direct correlation between the clock's ticking and the oscillator's motion. Time was shown to emerge from this entanglement, not as an external parameter, but as an intrinsic property of the system itself. This groundbreaking result challenges Einstein's passive view of time in general relativity, where time is simply a geometric dimension. If time actively influences quantum systems, the nature of space-time might need re-evaluation. While this experiment doesn't invalidate general relativity, it opens the door to a more unified theory of time, merging quantum mechanics with gravitational theory. Time may not just be a backdrop, but an active participant in the universe's fabric. As we continue exploring the mysteries of time, this discovery reminds us that the universe's fundamental nature is more complex than previously imagined. If you found this exploration fascinating, consider subscribing to our channel and liking the video to help us reach a broader audience and continue sharing groundbreaking scientific discoveries.